Uh, hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to teach you on how you can retarget uh, Mixamo animations to MetaHuman uh, skeleton, as you can see here. This is an animation from Mixamo, and it's working perfectly. Uh, there are no deformed mesh or skinning issue, or yeah, the, the fingers are totally correct, as you can see. And yeah, let's get started. So the first thing you need to do is to download this tool, Mixamo Converter. It's free. I will link leave a link down in the description below for you so you can download it. After you have downloaded it, go to the files. So Mixamo Converter. Here you can see it says SK Mannequin for Mixamo. Uh, drag this, go to Mixamo, you need to upload this uh, skeleton to Mixamo, so drag this here, wait for it until it uploads, ok now it has started processing it as you can see this is working. Uh, this is the default mannequin in Unreal, and the animations are working perfectly. Click next. As you can see, it's fine now. Search for an animation like walking. Uh, I'm going to choose this one. Click in place so that it's not moving. And now you can download this animation. Now in the download settings, make sure that you choose without the skin and uniform. 30 frames per second and FVX binary. Click download. Okay, uh, after you have downloaded, go find it where it's located and copy it. Go to the Mixamo converter, which we just, I just told you where to download it. Go to the initial folder here and paste it. And now run the program. and click this delete initial animations after conversion and click this button mix them all to unreal the animations have been converted and moved to the complete folder okay let's go to the complete folder and it says walking for ue4 now just import it into unreal Choose the mannequin, choose the default mannequin here. Okay, now we need to make a few changes to this uh, import animation. If you don't see this drop down, just click this arrow like, like this. If you click it, you, you're gonna get this. Uh, make sure import meshes in bone hierarchy is checked. Use default sample ra rate is checked and import bone tracks is checked uncheck this import custom attribute and the rest of them also should be unchecked just these three in this one, this one and this one now click import and you're gonna get this animation as you can see it's working properly but now we need to uh, retarget this animation to metahuman skeleton because normally you can't just retarget uh, Mixamo animations to metahuman animations. You need to first retarget to the default mannequin, then to uh, metahuman skeleton. Okay. And I have already imported this metahuman. Uh, let me just open it.
uh, here is my uh, meta human let's open it up and uh, let's open up skeleton as you can see now we need to do a few things open the retarget manager let's dock it here and select humanoid rig and uh, let's make this bigger because I can't see it and now you need to make a few changes to these uh, bones for the spine 1 select spine 1 for the spine 2 select spine uh, 3 and for the spine 3 select spine 5 and that's all you need to do save it and now for the animation go to the skeleton basically the default mannequin do the same open the retarget manager and select humanoid rig and that's all you need to do just save it close it and now now we need to do one more thing go to the metahuman folder common female if your metahuman is female go to female if, if it's male go, go to male <clears throat> so mine is female I go to female folder tall my, my metahuman is tall if yours is short or medium go to that, those folders I go tall underweight overweight normal weight mine is underweight and go to poses now we have all of these poses search for uh, retarget just search for retarget and you will get this pose open this up as you can see it's a pose a pose similar to the default mannequin and we're gonna need this because when you are retargeting animations both skeletons must have the same pose otherwise it's not gonna work so go here make sure it's selected go to the meta human skeleton open the retarget manager and actually uh, make this smaller because this annoying uh, compiling shaders thing is not allowing me to see go to the modify pose here and select the click this arrow so that it selects the pose that we just talked about and click import as you can see it's now imported you can see the difference it's very very minor difference but it's necessary so yeah that's just it now close this down go to the animation that we just imported right click retarget anim asset duplicate anim asset and click this meta human and now you're gonna see that we don't see the preview and that's because we didn't click this apply to assets click this and the preview now will show up so go do the same again duplicate anim asset click this and it's showing up now just click retarget and here we go perfectly retargeted and there are no deformed the fingers are working perfectly as you can see and yeah that's just it